Hello everybody, this is Ali Reza. Welcome to another tutorial of my YouTube channel, Kian.SmartHome. In another tutorial, which its link is in description, you learn how to install ESP Home on development boards with ESP32, especially Node MCU 32S. One of the benefits of ESP Home is that by connecting it to Home Assistant, you can enjoy using the board without programming experiences. On today's video, we'll integrate Home Assistant with Node MCU 32S running ESP Home while it is connected to Wi Fi network. To start, ESP Home add on must be installed on Home Assistant. You can do that by navigating to Supervisor Panel, Add on Store tab, find ESP Home add on among the list, open it by clicking on it. If the add-on is not installed in your Home Assistant, you should see install instead of start. Click on it and wait till installation completes. It may take a few minutes. After installation the add-on, click on start. Wait a few seconds till starting the add-on finishes. Then select open web UI. If you see 502 bad gateway error, this error, it means that the add-on is not started yet. Wait a few seconds, then refresh the page. For integration, a node must be created. To do that, click on the plus at the bottom right of the screen in this window that pops up, create configuration, set a name for your node. Naming your node only use lowercase letters, numbers, or dash. Then enter your Wi-Fi credentials so your device can connect to your wireless network. After entering credentials, I click on next. In this window, you should select your board, select your ESP device. I select pick a specific board from the drop down list. I select Node MCU 32S as I mentioned at the beginning of the video. This is my development board. After that, I click on next. Configuration created, close. After creating the node, a YAML file with a node will be created. By clicking on edit, you can add codes to the file and save it. Then by clicking on install, you can install the edited code on your board. The important part is here. I suggest you set a static IP for your board. You can copy and paste the code from description and set the IP as your network. While entering the codes, you have to be careful. If you enter wrong codes or in a wrong way, the install button here will be disabled. By entering these codes, I set a static IP for my device. Then I click on save. After that, I click on install. How do you want to install this on your ESP device? As I mentioned at the beginning of the video, my ESP device is flashed with ESP Home and it is connected to my Wi-Fi network. So I click wirelessly. Installation starts, wait till it completes. OTA successful, successfully uploaded program. Wi-Fi connection is established. You can see signal strength, the IPs and so forth. At this point, installation is completed. You can click on stop. 
and close the window. As you can see, ESP32 is online. It means that the connection between Home Assistant and ESP32 board is established. From now on, you can add some codes to your file by clicking on edit, then adding your desired codes to use the boards as switch or connecting sensors to it then save it and installing it to the board thank you for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done already by buying me a coffee you can support me to upload more videos i'll see you in the next video